Guys, can I ask your opinion what you think is going on? Oh. Well done, well done. People fall in love as well. Are you going to take a Ukrainian refugee into your house for £350 a month? Yes, that's my wife. Six months ago, I couldn't have my bird round, but now you're asking me for three fifty a month to have a fucking Ukrainian family in my house. Still wearing mask because one in 20 people have got it, and actually my boss has got coronavirus. Right, okay, and he's off work, and I I know for definite he's got coronavirus. Right, he can't even speak right, because okay. he's got coronavirus. I know he's not lying. So coronavirus affects your speech. It is. It's affected his speech. Right, okay. I don't know the coronavirus is quite. Varied. Yeah. The so you're doing that. Are you doing that to protect yourself protect from coronavirus? Yourself and other people. I thought you'd come dressed as Walter White out of uh, Breaking Bad. <laughs> hey mate, what do you think about what's happening here? Let's do it. It's embarrassing. Girls, what do you think's happening here? What do you think's going on? What do you think is going on? I have no idea. To be I've just got back from the shop, mate. <laughs> Absolutely no idea. Uh, obviously against COVID restrictions, I take it. Yeah, what, I think that's the general gist of it. What do you think about it? Uh, I had to think about it, to be honest. Yeah. <laughs> I got enough. <laughs> Fair enough. I think a lot of people I mean, are, aren't they? I'm happy. We have a blue sky today. Yeah. Travel from Germany, you can see Manchester. Oh, you're over from Germany? Yeah. Both of you? Yeah. All oh, right, which city? <laughs> Munich. Is this your first time in Manchester? No, no. All oh, right, and what brings you here? I love it. Just because you like Manchester? That's yeah. amazing. <laughs> yeah. Nothing in Cuba. Yeah, oh, fantastic. <laughs> you're great. Yeah, you like the way we all dress? Yes. Like these girls love here? It. We love it. <laughs> yeah. It's impressive. No, yeah. I mean, I think they're right to. Uh, someone has to say something. I mean, as I said, I'm tired about it. Yeah, what's it I like in Germany? What are the restrictions like over there? Uh, we are still wearing masks and still in half lockdown. And, yeah. Okay, yeah. right. Well, thanks for your time anyway. Do you mind me asking you what you think is going on? Not interested. I'm trying to cover it Not independently. Interested. Come on. A bag of shit. Right, why do you think that? Do you know what they're protesting about? About the vaccine, I'm right. assuming. Okay, what do you think about that? Is it real? Saying what, sorry? Thinking Corona isn't real is or that, something. Are they saying that? I don't know. Yeah. Uh, right. saying, don't believe the hype. Right, okay. But, do you think it has been hyped up or not? Well, yeah, because people have died. Right. Well, but do you think it's been hyped up beyond what it actually was? No, it's not like people no. have died. Um, um, right. He's older than he looks, mate. That'll do with him. He's older than he looks. Absolutely. Or younger than he looks. Okay. <laughs> If you don't want me to, you're you're a nurse and a pharmacist. What do you think about what what these are doing? Not really into it. Right. Oh, why is that? You know, can you give us your professional opinion if you don't mind. Hospital, right. This every day. Yeah. Well, I'm not interested in answering questions. About it. Okay. Right. I'll respect that, mate. No worries. I'll turn it off. And I noticed that you've got a nice pink mask which matches the pink right on your heart. Yeah. Okay. Are you really worried that you might get coronavirus or COVID? I got it twice. You got it twice? Yeah. Okay. Um, and have you had the vaccinations? Yeah. Did you get it before or after the vaccinations? Uh, after. So you got coronavirus after the vaccinations? Yeah. Okay. Um, so do you think the vaccinations might not have worked? I mean, in my case, I was asymptomatic because it's not... Oh. The vaccines are supposed to 
like help you know not make your situation severe. Right. I understand. So for me, I have a relatively easy. Right. And you've already had it, so why are you still wearing a mask? Well, the thing is because I'm afraid, you know, because of like me being asymptomatic. If I want to get it again, I can, you know, maybe give it to one of my friends or. Oh, so you're basically doing it to protect other people. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Thank you very much for taking the time to speak to me. Yes, that's my wife. Would you be prepared to do that? Yes, that's my wife. She's All right. in what do you think she'd say? <laughs> what do you think she'd say? Uh, I don't know. I'm very keen on it. Okay. Thank you. Would, would you be just as keen to take in a Yemeni refugee? I don't know. Why, why do you feel that? I'm trying to cover it independently. I do. I think that uh, things are good for all of us. What, what's good the for injections. all of us? Injections. Are. It's kept everybody safe, Oop. I think. Right, okay. Um, my opinion, I, uh, my opinion, everybody's entitled to an opinion. Yeah, of course, that's what, what I'm trying to get. I'm trying to get people's opinions. Yeah, I think um, it should be forced on anybody. If you want it, you want it. If you don't, you don't. Each to their own. But I don't agree with all this trying to force it on everybody. Right. Here's our concern. Don't be deceived the Guardian. Don't mention anything about it. Why are they hiding this from you? Pfizer just released nine pages of side effects for the vaccine. They knew about this September, uh, in February 2021. Did you know that Pfizer, the big pharmaceutical company, was one of the largest companies with the largest fines? Uh, they were fined in Nigeria for bribery and for fraud. Guys, can I ask your opinion what you think is going on? Oh, Why are you swearing? I'm just asking. That's a bit rude, right? What are you doing that for? Excuse me. Well, what did you do? I wasn't pushing you. You just stood right in front of me and backed up. Well, I was there. You've no more right than I have of being there. Pardon? I know, but I was still there. Yeah, but I was still stuck there. You know, you're so rude. Just, just walking into me. Just because you're wearing a costume, it doesn't give you any more rights than anybody else. I know, but you automatically believe that because you just push right into me. That's there for public display so we can see it. I've got it on camera anyway, so it doesn't matter. What happened? Pardon? What happened? This rude gentleman just bites in front of me because he felt he had more right to be there than I did. Yeah. Have you apologised? No, he hasn't. Would you house a Ukrainian refugee for £350 a month, which the government are offering? I'd probably do it for a short term, just to uh, for a couple of months, and then I'll assess the situation. Well, you've got to commit to a minimum of six months. No, I wouldn't know their background, so I probably would not do it. Thanks for your time, thank you. Go on, so what was it that you said? I'm just doing me. Okay, and you're not interested in anything no, that's going you. on? No. Okay, thank you very much. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm anti-vax. You're an anti-vaxxer? Yeah, I think anti th these are... Uh, you should join in then, you should follow on. Oh, I've got shit to do. Alright, okay, Sorry. anyway, cheers. Yeah. Guys, I make YouTube videos following things, can I just ask you a few questions about what you think's going on? <laughs> what do you think's going on, Gum? Ukraine's more important. Get your ass off. Uh, Ukraine's more important. Walk off. Okay, um, 
Would you? It's more important. They're getting invaded, and you're on about COVID from two years ago. I'm covering this independently. Independently, yeah. in my own opinion, Ukraine's more important. That's why there's fuck all people here protesting compared to all the other ones in Manchester. Deal with Ukraine. Okay, I've uh, got one question for you. Would you house a Ukrainian refugee for £350 a month? Well, 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 well one, one second. Just as like a British etiquette. Six months ago, I couldn't have my bird round, but now you're asking me for three fifty a month to have a fucking Ukrainian family in my house. That's not me saying it's a good or a bad thing, but I'm saying there's a fucking problem. There isn't there, yeah, I problem. absolutely agree. It's problem. crazy it's that you can bring someone in. Make right. Do you yeah. want to think you're thinking of Ukraine right now instead of all this shit that's going on because of what you've been told to think? I, I think COVID is going to be completely sidelined in compared to what's going on in the world right now. Do you not think that COVID's been sidelined because of what's going on in the world? No, 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 no. I want you to be told to know right now because we're not in Ukraine, are we? We're not in Ukraine, but there are people getting their houses bombed and we're still here going on about jabs and shit. Thanks very much for your time, guys. Much appreciated. Yeah, Cheers, thank you. I like it when people chat. God bless. Yeah. If you want to check the YouTube... Guys, if you want to check the YouTube channel, it's called Thoughts from the Edge of the Matrix. I just cover things like this, and I try and be as independent we're, we're as I can. We're not you're full of shit. See ya. <laughs> I'll put that on. <laughs> Cheers, guys. And <laughs> Enjoy your day, guys. Enjoy it. What you do, you do. Let him through, man. Let him through. Let him through. Let him through. He's okay. Let him through. Let him through. I do. Why I am standing here. I am Georgian and 20% of my country occupied by Russia. Georgian people know what Ukrainian people is feeling now and such a terrible situation is Ukraine now and such a hard time is for them and for their families. We are standing here because we want to know Georgian people suffer to you. Uh, we want to know Georgia stand with Ukraine. The first country was Georgia. The second one is Ukraine. Which country will be the next? War must stop the Putin, must stop the war. If the war stops the occupant today, this means they survive lots of kids' lives. Ukrainian soldiers today fighting in Ukraine not fighting in Ukraine just for freedom of, freedom of Ukraine. They are fighting freedom of Georgia too. They are fighting for Europe and they are fighting for peace. I am so proud because Georgian soldiers are already out in uh, Ukraine as well. And what? Thank you. Just yesterday and today, three of them died fighting against against the occupant. So they are heroes in my country. They are Georgian heroes. And Georgian soldiers always say.
feeling. I got the spirit. 